actually doing something. Stop mm. that. Yeah. You got time to hate. You ain't got no time to get no bread. I tell people <laughs> yeah. all the time. You know, you sitting around hating. You don't have nothing because you hating. Then you wake up the next morning and angry because your boy already surpassed you. Again. Yeah, yeah. And you, you... We're not just making gains. We're making six-figure gains. Don't forget to smash the subscribe button. What up, YouTube? In today's video, I'll show you the steps I have taken to help me do a pistol squat. A pistol squat is a great way to target your hamstrings, quads and calves. I will show you four steps that will help you build up to doing a pistol squat. So the first one is to do a normal squat. You want to get into this position, legs shoulder width apart. You want to bring yourself down, hips this low and then bring yourself back up and that is one squat once you've mastered squats then the next step will be seating pistol squats so doing this technique will help build your confidence and it will also help build strength in your legs So the next step is an assisted pistol squat. For this, I'm using a pulse to help me with my balance. This technique will help you build up confidence and help you build up strength in your legs at the same time. The next step is to do an elevated pistol squat. For this exercise, you'll need something that you can step on, like I have. And then you can perform a pistol squat. This will give your leg more room to maneuver. Once you've mastered the four steps, you can then move on to doing a pistol squat. So when you're doing a pistol squat, you want to get this low and at this point you do not want your balancing foot on the floor. This exercise helps build lower body and core strength. This is also great as it doesn't require any equipment and is very effective for lower body. If you want to challenge yourself even more, you can do this technique where you grab the end of your shoe or your trainers and then you perform a pistol squat. This will help your legs from dangling and will ensure that you don't touch the floor with your balancing foot.